guys so um first of all before i even continue i'm oh, sorry for my face i just came out of the shower and i just threw on like a shiz load of coconut oil and yeah so sorry for the glossiness but this is going to oh my god this is going to be a um a hair update slash hair maintenance video i've never done this before and i feel like i really should because my channel has always been geared towards like hair stuff but i never really did anything that has to do with my own hair and as i told you guys in my tmi tag i told you guys how i've been on a hair journey for like the past two to three years now for me personally i feel like my hair grew a lot um because my hair doesn't grow like super fast and I just been like making sure I take care of it and I oil it and you know I moisturize it really well so um, I'm gonna show you guys what I've been using on my hair since it's not been like in the um, weaves um, I'm actually thinking of twisting up my hair I <laughs> oh god as you guys can see on the floor right over there I have um I have Marley hair and I'm thinking of not thinking I'm twisting up my hair into Marley hair and I have to thank one of my favorite youtubers on her on here uh, on here her name is um, the brilliant beauty I love her channel and she just like showed the most detailed tutorial of how to like put in these like you know Havana twist Marley twist I don't even know the difference between them but like like it looks so good and I was like I need to do this because like after I watched hers I was watching tons of like other people's stuff and I was like I need to do this to my hair so um I, I decided that that's what I want to do so I'm just going to show you guys like what Usually, I do I really try not to put any heat on my hair I'm trying to grow out my hair and I'm trying to have it um you know armpit length Right now, it's past my shoulders now, so I'm really happy that it's past my shoulders. Um, but I can show you guys, it's like, I feel like it's just not a lot of hair to be like really showing off. I feel like it's really nothing. But um, that's like the side, this is the back. Okay, and then the other side, and then the front of my hair. So as you guys can see, the edges, um, they're growing back, like there wasn't really much there before. I still have like this little spot right here, and then over here as well, but um, oh, and then also I got like terrible like heat damage from always wearing my hair in the middle. So like the middle of my hair is like, you know, it's pretty short in the middle. So I've been trying to make sure that I don't touch the, that touch that section of my hair. Um, but like right now, what I did was that I washed and shampooed my hair with the Suave Professionals um, Almond and Shea Butter. Ooh, conditioner and shampoo. And then I came out of the shower and then I just like soaked my hair in the cocoa butter, I mean ugh, cocoa butter, coconut oil and then I combed my hair and um, it's been air drying a little bit. The way that I air dry my hair is pretty simple and I love doing it this way and also it really helps with those who want to stretch out, stretch out their hair as well, um, who are transitioning also. I like doing this because it really it doesn't cause a lot of tangles with the hair and if you have a lot of new growth it makes it easier as well so I'm just combing through everything making sure everything is laying flat so then when it air dries in the style that I'm gonna be showing you guys it's going to be air dried straight Except for the ends. The ends are going to be like a little bit, it's going to look a little bit curly, but I like that. So then when I'm like wearing it in buns and stuff, you know, it has a little bit texture to it. So this is my hair combed out and I'm going to get a brush and I'm just going to make sure everything is laying flat. 
by brushing everything back. Now this is the cool part. So you're gonna get some rubber bands. I got this from like Walgreens, it was like $3 for like 500 of them. And I use about like three of them, so I'm gonna get one. <laughs> And then I'm just going to secure it. So um, this is how it's going to look. And then I'm going to get more oil because I like to make sure that my ponytail is really, really moisturized. It's a little bit dry right now. So I just like throw a lot of it on make sure I put a lot at the end then I'm gonna get another rubber band and I'm gonna secure it like a little bit close to like where I put it before okay so I'm gonna get another one Okay, and then the end is gonna look like that. Usually I don't put one at the end because it usually falls off when I'm sleeping. So um, I usually just do three of them. Then I'm going to get uh, one of these type of hair nuts. I need to buy another one because I think I overstretched this when I was wearing my weave. My weave always overstretches my freaking hair nuts. So I'm just gonna place it right here. Place it right here. And then secure it in the back. Okay. And then that is all. Okay. And I secured the ponytail in in it as well, like inside. So yep, that's pretty much it. And then um I also I do uh, protective styles. I bun my hair. Yeah, that's pretty much what I usually do. I bun my hair, and then if I'm going somewhere like really special, I just I, I I gel up my edges and make it really make it look really nice. Or, you know, I would straighten it if I really need to, but usually I don't. So, yeah. So that's all, you guys. Hopefully, then when I come with the next video, my hair is going to be done with the Havana twist. Or Marley, I think it's Marley Twist. Yeah, I don't think it's Havana because I didn't use Havana hair. So hopefully you guys will see me in it and I hope it looks good because I'm going to be so sad. But you guys stay tuned for my next video. Um, and I hope you guys have an awesome and blessed day. And make sure you guys stay well, okay? Love you all. Bye.